Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. If you always watch our channel, you may know that the importance of lithography machine. The lithography machine is a necessary equipment for the production of chips, but the shipment of lithography machines and other equipment is restricted, especially the lithography machines developed and manufactured by ASML. It is reported that the EUV lithography machine developed and manufactured by ASML cannot be freely shipped without permission, and the shipment of DUV lithography machine is relatively loose. According to the news released by ASML, Chinese manufacturers have already ordered an EUV lithography machine in full, but ASML cannot deliver it due to various factors. At the same time, DUV lithography machines manufactured in the United States cannot be shipped to Chinese manufacturers without a license. To this end, ASML has been striving for free shipping licenses and said that it will provide Chinese manufacturers with all the technologies it can provide and also increase its layout in the Chinese market. Earlier, the United States asked ASML to tighten the scope of international lithography machine shipments. ASML said that restricting the shipment of DUV lithography machines will lead to the interruption of the global semiconductor industry chain. It is necessary to consider the importance of Chinese manufacturers in the field of chip manufacturing. Subsequently, ASML officially stated that it will expand the production capacity of lithography machines, including 90 EUV and 600 DUV systems, 2025 to 2026, and will increase the high NA EUV production capacity to 20 systems, 2027 to 2028. In addition, ASML also officially announced the construction of a new factory in Taiwan province with an investment of 30 billion new Taiwan dollars, which is several times higher than ASML's investment in South Korea in terms of investment scale. In this regard, some foreign media said that ASML has officially stated its attitude and more lithography machines will be shipped to the Chinese market in the future. In fact, ASML has been improving its shipment capabilities to the Chinese market. In the first quarter of this year, 23 DUV lithography machines were shipped. The Chinese market surpassed the United States in one fell swoop and became ASML's third largest market. Today, ASML not only refuses to tighten the scope of shipments of DUV lithography machines, but also increases its production capacity and builds a factory in Taiwan province. With the increase in the production capacity of advanced lithography machines and the advent of high NAEUV lithography machines, ASML is expected to ship freely. More Advanced Equipment it is understood that ASML made such a decision mainly because of the following points. First of all, the Chinese market is the largest chip consumer market. At present, many Chinese manufacturers have begun to develop and produce their own chips. Imported chips have fallen by more than 12% year-on-year, a decrease of more than 61 billion. The more chips are produced in China, the more equipment such as lithography machines will be needed. In addition, new energy vehicles are the future trend. China is the largest consumer of new energy vehicles and the largest exporter. The production and manufacture of new energy vehicles requires a lot of chips. Compared with mobile phones, automobiles are a larger industrial chain. With more automotive chips being manufactured in China, the demand for lithography machines will naturally increase further. What's more, the Chinese market has surpassed the United States to become the third largest market, and ASML cannot freely ship products. Secondly, ASML can ship more because ASML's lithography machine manufacturing technology is the most advanced, and other manufacturers cannot replace it. According to the information released by ASML, ASML's lithography machine technology comes from more than 40 countries around the world, hundreds of suppliers, and the United States does not have the ability to independently manufacture lithography machines. 
In addition, in the lithography machines produced by ASML, the proportion of American technology is limited. The United States revises the rules and restricts shipments, so the impact on the shipment of ASML lithography machines is limited. What's more, Chinese manufacturers have made many breakthroughs in advanced lithography machines and have won 80% of the lithography machine market in China and 40% of the global packaging lithography machine market. If ASML does not achieve more shipments of lithography machines, the result, as the president of ASML said, will withdraw from the Chinese market in the future. Under such circumstances, ASML naturally tried to ship it, so foreign media said that ASML officially made its attitude clear, China is pursuing a result. In order to completely cure the restricted fate, it must achieve technological autonomy. The United States will not let China's semiconductor industry be better, and domestic companies will naturally not let American companies be better. Among the relevant restrictions the development of the global semiconductor industry is slowing down, which also brings us an excellent opportunity for breakthroughs. The toughness of the Chinese market has also won the respect that the market deserves. ASML, as the only supplier of EUV lithography machines, has now chosen to compromise and bet everything to ensure its market share in China, and US companies have also begun to warn together, is it too late for this series of actions to restore the free authorization of the chip? The market pattern is reshuffled. After being asked to cut off the supply of DUV lithography machines, ASML chose a showdown and the Netherlands did not choose to compromise in the face of constant pressure from the old United States. It not only acknowledged the acquisition of Wingitech technology, but also decided whether to cut off the supply. The right to choose is left to the enterprise. In such a market environment, making such a choice is really commendable. The situation of TSMC is different. As the person in charge of the company, Liu Dang insists on building a factory in the United States. What is even more outrageous is that he has also received the support of the relevant person in charge of Taiwan province. No matter how hard Zhong Zhongmu works in the future, he cannot change the general operation. Direction a large number of factories in the United States are difficult to achieve profitability. This is the conclusion based on market research. Even American companies such as Intel and Qualcomm understand such a simple truth, but TSMC insists on jumping into the fire pit, which is doomed. No one can save it. After ASML's hardness took effect, American companies also began to follow suit. At present, more than 50 American companies such as Apple, Qualcomm, NVIDIA, etc. have formed an alliance. Surprisingly, under pressure, the one-year authorization was really released. However, the restrictions on the authorization of this year are relatively confusing. No one can guarantee what the situation will be in a year. Therefore, no company dares to invest in this time period. It can be said that the old American trick is quite clever, which can not only keep these companies silent, but also achieve the purpose of continuous restrictions. ASML is relatively bold. It not only expanded its R&D and maintenance centers in the Chinese market, but also established a number of new offices. It intends to expand the number of Chinese employees to 1,700 and it also announced an important decision. In 2025, DUV will be launched. The production capacity of lithography machines has been expanded to 600 units, which is obviously preparing for the subsequent large-scale shipment to the Chinese market. And these US companies dare not do this, because being tough means betrayal. The situation at that time is not optimistic. It is very likely that the companies will no longer exist. A good effect can only be achieved in a short time. What do you think of this?